Hi, I'm Jordan from Kettner Creative. In this video, I want to show you what you need to know in order to split a single stereo channel into two separate mono channels using GarageBand. Now, this is extremely useful. Oftentimes, if you're out on set recording, you're going to put one microphone in the left, one microphone on the right, you bring it back to your laptop, and now you need to separate it so then you can mix each channel individually. This is extremely common with things like video interviews or something like that. So here I have a GarageBand project file in front of me, and you can see here that there's a single stereo track with two different sides to it. I'm just gonna play it back. This is what the left microphone sounds like. This is what the right microphone sounds like. Perfect. So you can see there we have a left and a right microphone with an audio clip that will help us differentiate both of them. So what we're going to do is we're going to hit Command D, one, two, three. So we have four different audio tracks here. And then we're going to Alt drag that first one down four times. Now stick with me here. The first one is going to be left. We're going to pan it left. The next one's going to be right. Then we're going to go right again then we're going to go left. And that's what we need to do there. Let's go raise this up. So on the f second channel now, we're going to come down in the bottom. This plugins might be closed or this track might be on master or something. Just open this up, open track, go to plugins. We're going to add a gain channel here. So that gain and then on, when it's a pop up here, we're going to change it to swap stereo channels. Now we're going to do that same thing on the channel four. Add a gain and swap it there. So now when we play it back, we're going to have these two will combine to make a mono of what used to be the left channel. And these two, three and four, will combine to make a mono of what used to be the right channel. So then we're going to just hit play here. This is so what look the in left the top microphone right here, sounds you can like. see that it is mirrored. This is what the right microphone sounds like. So there, we have a stereo kind of, we have two different tracks that combine to make a stereo of each track. So what I would do now is I would mute three and four, and then I would uh, hit share, export song to disc, and that would render out your, what used to be your left as a single channel. And then I come back into the software, mute one and two, unmute three and four, and then I would hit share, export song to disk, and render out what would be the right channel. So I hope this video is helpful. If you want to see more videos like this in the future, please like and subscribe. If you have any questions about this, please leave a comment in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.